Thank you. So, this is a big prize at the end of this challenge, and that's been turning for Bjorn's restaurant. But there's something else there, and that is the reward for the winning team. Something you all will want. The first dish we would like to taste is the blue tea. I am very proud of what we have made together as a team, and I hope the judge will like it. Good. So what we did is we used the chickpea to make an apple sauce okay. with garam masala and cinnamon. With the baked beans, we used the sauce and a little bit of the beans for the lamb. Carefully. There's a punch of flavor. Lamb cooked perfectly. Thank you. Flavors, spices, seasoning spot on. Absolutely spot on. I don't think there's a lot that I can fault with this dish at all. Thank you. Do you, do you have a name for this dish? Let's not get chopped. Let's not get chopped. <laughs> Lamb's cooked really well. Okay. Thank you, Chef. My only issue with the dish is the sauce. I taste more baked beans than anything else. Other than that, very well executed. If Chef feels that you know, it's a little too beany that that might not be in favour of us, but we like the taste of it. Yellow. Come on up. We have done everything that we possibly can, and I really, really want to win this for Pollen. Tell me what you've done here. So we have the butter basted lamb and eiling mushrooms okay. with a bit of curry leaf. Okay. And on top is a caramelized onion sauce okay. reduction yes. with a bit of garam masala. Stress. <laughs> Done really well with the mushrooms. It is a meaty piece of meat, right? But it's delicious. The lamb. A little bit on the rare side for me. It'll be more tender if you'd cooked it and let it rest for a little bit longer. Yeah? Well, well done, though. I love the energy. <laughs> Thanks, girls. You get me. Hello. <laughs> yeah, all your individual components are nice. But I wish one thing stood out and said, hey, look at me. But overall, nice dish. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. I feel that a bit like disappointed, but at least now I, I learned and then I know uh, the standard of the lamb that should be cooked. Red team, please step forward. Frankly speaking, right, other people, they always discourage my food. I have to prove to everyone I can be a chef. So this is Aladdin. It's as vague as you don't know whether Aladdin's Indian or Arab. Right. So this is Indian or Arab. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what was the inspiration for this dish? Indra was telling me that she loves to cook Indian food. Right. So I'm, I was confident that okay, she can make a mean curry. We also got the weird mushroom thing. Piling. Piling. Okay. So I pan fried it and then I just dumped it into the curry that she cooked. Okay. Let's cut the lamb. I think this is the only way to eat it. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Every component was done very well. Every component. The texture from the pickle, okay. the masala, the mushrooms. Okay. If someone came here and ate this, they would never know it was biting. Never. I cannot fault it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Receiving a good comment from a stranger. Wow. He's a chef. I feel that moment I was, okay, I can do it. Okay.
Yeah. Last of all, the green team, yep. please oh. bring forward your dish. I feel nervous. Even my leg was shaky a bit. <laughs> I really want that internship because that is one part of my dream. I was eyeing this from very far away because it was a very sexy looking dish. I mean, come on, look at that, guys. Pretty good. Does it get better looking than that? What was the uh, canned ingredient that you guys had to work with? Mushroom soup. Tell me. We make apples like a puree. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we mix it with your mushroom. Have you tried we that blend before? It. No, our oh. first time then. <laughs> Your lamb is cooked perfectly. Thank you. Loving that. Loving the apple chip. Is that bitter corn or just apple? Yes, bitter corn. Uh, bitter corn. Fried as well. These two things together. Boom. Wow. This mushroom and apple thing is totally thought-provoking to me right now. So I'm going to sit on that and see whether or not I'm on the side of loving it or not so hot about it. But it's definitely very memorable. Thank you, Chef. Thank you, sir. with a less creamier, not so, I don't know sauce, I think it would have been a hit. But having said that, the lamb was done very well. The chips were brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, Chef. Chef. Please. I feel really bad about that. Sauce, but the internship is up for takes now, and I hope that I've helped Surya enough to get her that spot. You guys work incredibly well together. We've just had the best, best afternoon watching you guys. You came in here not knowing what you were going to get yourself into, and look what you came up with. It was incredible. We'd like to send you all off winning, but there were two dishes that really stood out to us. So when I call your team colour, please come forward. First team. Red team. The second team that really blew us away was... The blue team. Thank you. Good job to be here. I hope to have a chance to win the internship. I feel that it will bring closer to my dream. I don't have a very good qualifications, so if I have this internship, it's going to be pursue my career. Look, we have to choose one winner. And I personally think that one dish stood out over the other because of one element. And that was... the apple and onion acha that completely tied every component on your dish together so perfectly and it added that freshness and acidity. So congratulations, Red Team. Thank you. You win. Guess who's back? Back again. Charmy's back, yep. But this time with Indra. <laughs> because you win, Indra, you get to spend some time with me at my restaurant, Artichoke, for an internship as long as short as you want. I have that the internship in my hand now, so... I feel happy. I feel very blessed, yeah. On top of that, you guys are going to be even more pleased about your win tomorrow when you guys are in the box seat. <gasps> we don't have to cook. <laughs> <laughs> to all our rookies, your MasterChef mentoring has just begun. We will be wrapping it up tomorrow, and there's more to be won. So, for now, let's celebrate a successful MasterChef initiation. Come on. Next time, the veteran seek redemption. Welcome to your restaurant takeover. And the rookies have one last chance to impress. I have to win tonight. Cooking for a packed restaurant. Needy families and a Singaporean 